we're going to go over how to use call out extensions um, in AdWords. So let's start here. You're at your main cam campaign screen. You want to come into the campaign where you want to add call outs to. So our campaign is PPC Marketing Management. We have two ad groups here. <clears throat> so what you want to do is come over to Add Extensions. Um, so from this drop down, you'll see there's different options. We're automatically in call out here. There's three different levels where you can add your call out extensions. So there's account extensions, campaign extensions, ad group extensions. So account extensions, let's just say, these are things where it would work for your entire account, things that don't really change regardless of the ad group. So for the minimum is at least two and they recommend you do four. So we're just going to do two at the account level. Um, we're going to do four at the uh, campaign and ad group level. So call out text. So let's just say I won an award last year for number one PPC agency. So we're going to do number one PPC agency. So this is good for your account because it doesn't really matter which ad group you're in. It's relevant for all the you know for every single different call out here and for our second call out let's see what uh let's just say call out text i want con i want people to contact me right away so let's just do contact us now so this is going to be our our call out text at the account level so some best practices for call outs is I generally don't use the 25 characters that you're given. So you'll see here, there's 25 characters in a single callout. Um, Google AdWords will show two to four callouts. So if you can keep your uh, text down, they'll be more likely to show more of your callouts. So for now, we're going to click Save. So now we have two account level callout extensions here. And they've both been, obviously, any campaign that comes in here, these are going to be added to. Um, and they're good because they're both relevant no matter which, you know, really which campaign I do, because every campaign I do, I'm going to want to contact, want people to contact me, and I'm also want people to know that I'm a PPC agency. So those are account level, campaign level. So we only have our one campaign here. So, so the main thing to remember with call out extensions is that it's just text. It's basically a way to tell people, you know, different things about your business, but. Uh, whereas site links, you can kind of send people to different pages on your website. So you could say, you know, if you're doing site links, you might do something like a case study or something like that where you're sending that traffic there. You don't necessarily want to do that with call outs. Uh, what you want to do is just give quick little tidbits of information that really will help people kind of select you instead of your competitor. So at our campaign level, uh, let's go with affordable services. So we're going to save that one. So now we're telling people basically, you know, it's, it's not going to cost them much to choose us over a competitor. Um, our next one. So now we have a lot of experience here. So let's go with seven. Let's see what the best way to look. So now we're saying we have seven, over seven years of experience. Um, as you'll see, we're trying to keep these character counts down so that more of them will show. And let's see one more. And let's just say 24 hour phone service. So now we're basically telling people, you know, you can call us at any time. And also if you become our client at any time, you can call us and we'll manage basically the issue that you have. Um, so now let's say our last call out, let's say I only want new clients with a budget of $2,000 or more. So let's say minimum budget 2000 so now anybody who comes to me with a $1,500 budget or something like that, they're going to kind of know that the minimum budget we're accepting is $2,000, hopefully, and it helps to pre-qualify some of your visitors. So we're going to click Save down here. So now we have four new call-out extensions here for our campaign level. So our account level, we have two here. Campaign, we have four more. So ad group extensions. So we're going to be quick here with the ad group ones. We're just going to show an example for AdWords management. You'd want to add them to separate ad groups where they make sense. Um, but right now we're in AdWords management. So for ad group extension, 
All right, so once this loads, click new call out here. Uh, so we're going to do number one, AdWords agency. All right, so we want to do at least two at the ad group level. So let's do AdWords experts. So they're kind of similar. I mean, the two call out extensions are pretty similar to each other in the ad group level, but we want them to ma to match this here. So. So now we have a bunch of call-out extensions. We have some at the ad group level here. We have some at the campaign level. We have some at the account level. Um, so now they're just going to show as we go. And what, what AdWords will automatically do is show the call-out extensions that tend to perform the best. You'll see here the, the statistics for your call-out extensions. So you can kind of ma monitor them and manage them as you go, depending on what you want to show up with your ads. Um, what AdWords does is they show two to four call-out extensions per ad when you're showing them. They're not always going to show them depending on what other ad extensions you have enabled, but basically AdWords uses their discretion based on the data they have, based on based on basically everything as to what's going to drive results, and if they feel call out extensions are the best option, then they're going to show up. There's no downside to adding call out extensions. Over time, they're only going to help your ad. They're only going to improve your ad's click-through ratio, which helps your ad rank, helps your quality scores. So. It's important to add call-out extensions. There's really no reason not to add them. 